you will learn hundreds of new English words that come from Latin. You will become more nimble in reading, speaking, and writing English. You will expand your vision and your way of thinking for the rest of the class, the rest of the year, and the rest of your life. Galileo once said, Mathematics is the language with which God has written the universe. At the Monfort Academy, our math courses are taught first and foremost with the objective that students come to understand the beauty and objectivity of mathematics. We want our students to learn to appreciate how mathematical concepts and relationships taught in daily lessons reflect the infinite goodness and intelligence of God. At Modfort, the arts are a proud and ennobling part of our curriculum, enriching the thinking of our students, not just throughout their time at school here, but throughout their lives. We believe that a deep and nuanced understanding and appreciation of the arts is essential to a classical education and to creating not just whole and rounded students, but whole and rounded people. Our embrace of the arts here at Montfort is pervasive and passionate, and that passion, sensitivity, and understanding is returned by our wonderful students in their own embrace of the arts. Montfort Academy's history courses are grounded in the firm conviction that ideas and people matter. Our teachers believe that history students should be exposed to the writings of Plato, Aristotle, Cicero, St. Thomas Aquinas, John Locke, John Adams, Thomas Jefferson, Alexis D. Tocqueville, Maya Angelou, Abraham Lincoln, Teddy Roosevelt, and Dr. Martin Luther King. Its two full-time history teachers work hard to show how great ideas, ideas like quality before the law and the unexamined life is not worth living, have influenced the course of history. Students in our society need to read complex texts. Educational experts say that an essential part of improving reading ability is making students read books that are a bit beyond them. Books many of them will struggle to understand by themselves, but which they can read and understand with the assistance of a teacher. That means literature, I think, like The Great Gatsby, like Augustine's Confessions, like the fiction of Flannery O'Connor, like T.S. Eliot's poetry, like Joyce's A Portrait of the Artist as a Young Man, like Shakespeare's Julius Caesar, like Dante's Divine Comedy. There are some works one needs to be familiar with to be able to take part in the great conversation of Western civilization. In my freshman grammar and composition class, students learn the basic building blocks of language. By learning its foundation, we are able to better understand, appreciate, and utilize God's beautiful gift of language. Moreover, it prepares our students so that they will not, at the mention of words like argument or analysis, jump away from the table. Instead, our students, as Montfort students always do, will lean in and embrace the challenge. In the health class, we teach advanced first aid, CPR, the Heimlich Maneuver, the devastating travesties of drugs and alcohol, and the virtues of abstinence. I also teach business course to seniors where they learn real life budgeting, portfolio strategies, and risk management. I'm also the athletic director here and phys ed teacher. The sports program is an integral part of the Montfort Academy. A Montfort student athlete is a competitor who plays to win, has respect for their opponent and their sport, is loyal to the school, their coach and their teammates. Philosophy promotes humility in the pursuit of truth, but it is also guided by the unrelenting questioning of the human mind, that pressing desire to understand something, the refusal to be satisfied by the cover story. And this is partially why philosophy is important for high school students. They are filled with questions and unafraid to test some boundaries to get answers. All truth is God's truth, Augustine would say, and its pursuit will lead us to nothing short of that perfect union with him. Theology is the heart of who we are here at the Montfort Academy. It's not simply a class, but it is a way of life to the faculty and the students alike. 
It's accomplished in the way that we treat one another, and in doing so, we create a safe and happy environment here at the Academy. The world has become a very dark and confusing place. Most are not able to see clearly right from wrong, good from evil. Our goal is to teach our children how to change that so that they become the best examples for others in the world to follow, and in doing so, can change others and then change the world into a safe and happy environment as well.